Okay, last one on this planet. The Lothlorien House of Light. We get down here, we'll have a quick look. It's a still on the tree planet house, so tree house planet. Tree house planet, I meant to say, not tree planet house. As you can see, it's dark anyway, so we're going to be landing any second. So a quick scan around, see what we got. Oh, never mind, it's the base. We're land. Damn it. I can never get used to this first person crap. Ah, uh, third person outside the ship view. Yeah, oh, I, I don't know what they are, third, second, 98th person. So we're going to wait for dark, uh, daylight. I nearly said dark. All right, daylight. Right, the first step is, where's the, it seems fairly close actually. Let's go, oh, there it is, right. Back to the, uh, Base computer somewhere. Oh, there he is, hiding in a bush. Let's get this bush. Okay. Oh, oh. well, they're hiding in a bush. Wait, I've got no. I got to kill that. I don't want to die. I got no protections. It'll respawn. It's fine. <laughs> These damn things are annoying. Right, I've killed him. Right, here's the uh, base computer. Let's just grab the coordinates. Right, that's done. Um, nice of him to hide it in a bush. <laughs> I know they're ugly, but you don't have to go that far. Um, where was me? Where's the damn ship? Oh, right, over here. Let's get onto the ship. Ooh, there it is. There's the electric. Doesn't seem to be producing much. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, you know, it's only using 30,000, 100,000 available. So I don't know where there's a, oh, there is a battery. Yeah, I can just see the battery and the wire hider. So, this is a lot bigger, get up the stairs. Let's have a look around the um, landing pad. Uh, there's a load of lights. It, it's actually quite cute in night time. All the lights lit up. See why it's called um, House of Light. So there's lights everywhere. They're not, um, they're ceiling lights, aren't they? And I don't know, is that another light? And what are they? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Some I don't bloody use. You know me, I never use anything. Okay, so crossing the bridge into the main door. Try not to spin too fast for you because I get dizzy. Uh, we got the teleport as usual. Probably biggest power usage. Uh, a save point, thank you very much. And a teleport. There, yeah, see? Now what's on the table? Um Corvax um porn videos. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, so another little light bulbs. Is that upside down as well? Okay. Right, this is a bigger than my tree outside when I was a kid so up we go first level um, there are obviously extra trees planted because they don't show up no they don't show up um, the, so that's down there now um, uh, extra trees like I say planted to make it look more like a, a tree tree house mm -hmm. what's that bit of wood in there for mm -hmm. perhaps you didn't like the bark it's covered <laughs> wait the the bark is covered in leaves mm. never noticed that before so we got more leaves there's a ringed planet up there tree planted 
up round the bar, uh, the main trunk of this. Lots of stairs. Into another smaller room with um, data tapes. <laughs> I don't know. Could be anything. Um, here we go. Up again. View gets better as you go up, obviously. Because I like I like building in the sky personally, but. You can't have everything. You can sit down and have his coffee. Coffee. Leaves, I've never noticed that. Have they always been like that? What's that? It's one of those pillars of light things, isn't it? A tree next door neighbour. <laughs> A tree. I wonder if they talk. Uh, that's my ship, obviously. Yeah, I always bring it with me in case I need some medical help. You never know when you're going to need medical help. Because I keep all my um, stuff low usually because I do a lot of galaxy jumping. So rather than fix it all the time, I just, just <laughs> leave it. This must be the sitting room. Um... With more bits and pieces. I don't know if it's supposed to be books or whatever, but that's obviously posters over the top of whatever they are. I, I really don't know. To be honest, I don't use objects that I can't really see the point for. Uh, only because I don't use a lot. Of crap because I need all the space I need to build all the bases on every galaxy as you're probably aware by now anyway so anyway next level may just have a nice bit of rug I don't remember a rug in my bloody treehouse uh, what we um some sort of bed I don't know maybe more videotapes. Gex does Gallux. Ga Gallus? Dallas, I meant to say. So it's a misty, murky planet. It's, it's a rather nice planet, actually. Like I say, but this could be the last base I look at on this planet. I usually choose three out of um, you know, a planet that's got loads of bases you could be there forever otherwise and you'll find some of them are really no more than shacks so but this one's handy at least you can't get lost <laughs> one room leads to the next that's it more of the same thing tapes or books tree in a pot definitely extra trees Is that I don't know oh we got another one of these oh nice nice um there's a seat and this must be the top level lights hanging off the ceiling they don't look like they need electricity so that's why there's not a lot of electricity used so I sit in the seat hello it's me oh great lovely <laughs> facing the wrong way uh, we're shuddering I think there's some oh, I don't know why it's doing that it's only when I'm looking Let's get off Yeah, they're not shaking anymore. And it's now becoming darker again. Let's have a quick look up on the roof. And there's the top of the world, according to this tree else. What the hell's that? I don't know. Oh, gold or something. 
as it was on this planet. So it's a quick visit on this one because there's, it's a straightforward room followed by a room followed by a room. You can't get lost. I like not getting lost. And now I'm jumping. Oh no, I fell off actually. I just thought I'd say I'd jump. And we're going to leave that one here. I like this one. It's simple. And I can't get lost. The main thing for me of bases is not getting lost. I'll see you later.